Hello YouTube and welcome to my channel. I am a gigantic fan of science fiction movies and TV shows and I've always loved the Star Trek universe created by Gene Roddenberry, including Star Trek Voyager. Now recently, I learned about some animosity that occurred between Kate McGrew, who played Captain Catherine Janeway, and Jerry Ryan, who played Seven of Nine the beautiful Borg who joined the series in its fourth season. Now in this video I take a look at the backgrounds of these two actresses and discuss the reason for the tension between them. Kate Mulgrew is an actress who's had numerous TV roles in her career including the role of Mrs. Columbo in 1979, a spin-off of the TV series Columbo, an extremely popular detective series that had starred the legendary actor Peter Falk. Unfortunately, that series was not as well received as Columbo and was cancelled after the second season and just 13 episodes in total. Peter Falk, who had played Columbo, was fairly vocal in his disapproval of this spin-off series. Mulgrew had also been a cast regular on the daytime soap opera Ryan's Hope, appearing in 421 episodes in total between 1975 and 1989. Then, in 1995, Mulgrew landed the role of Catherine Janeway on Star Trek Voyager, the fourth television series in the Star Trek universe, and this role made her the first female captain as a series regular in a leading role in the Star Trek franchise. And Mulgrew has talked about that responsibility that she felt of playing Captain Janeway. She knew that to many young girls and young women, she was someone they admired and she didn't take that responsibility lightly. In fact, according to Rick Berman, the show's executive producer, he's gone so far to refer to Kate Mulgrew as Star Trek royalty. The exposure that she had received due to her portrayal of Captain Janeway included hanging out with astronauts, spending time with Hillary Clinton even, and even becoming a somewhat spokesperson for women in leadership roles. Then, in the fourth season of Star Trek Voyager, a new character called Seven of Nine was introduced played by actress Jerry Ryan. Seven of Nine was part of the Borg, an alien race of cybernetic organisms linked in a hive-like mind called the Collective. She had been assimilated into the Borg as a young girl. Eventually, Seven of Nine's link to the Borg Collective is severed and she remains on the Starship Voyager as part of the crew. A little bit about Jerry Ryan, she had been picking up parts on television shows starting around 1991 when she had her first television appearance as a guest on Who's the Boss. Undoubtedly though, it was her role on Star Trek Voyager that was really the first big break for her career. And while ratings for Star Trek Voyager had never been stellar when compared to TV shows from the major networks, Voyager had been one of the top shows for the UPN network and when they added Seven of Nine, there was a huge boost to the ratings. With that said, it turns out that not everyone was a fan of the new character. Apparently, tension had started building between Kate Mulgrew and Jerry Ryan. In fact, Rick Berman has told of a time he remembers when members of the press were on stage and just sort of ignored Kate and pushed through to get to Jerry. He says it was clear that there was some tension between these two actresses right through the show's end. Another cast member even remembers a time that Kate Mulgrew insisted that Jerry Ryan only be allowed to use the bathroom before or after work, but not during, claiming that it took her too much time to get in and out of that suit. Kate Mulgrew herself has addressed this issue and stated that while she thinks Jerry Ryan did a great job, it was clear to anyone with eyes that Ryan's appeal was her beauty and her sexuality which was a very important factor for Star Trek Voyager when it came down to numbers. And, as the boost in ratings show, it worked. Mulgrew was pretty disappointed in the whole thing, stating that she thought that perhaps UPN and Paramount would forego this and that maybe, just maybe, they would get behind the female captain idea a little bit more strongly. Obviously, the show's demographic proved they wanted more sex and they got that in a very beautiful, and talented woman in Jerry Ryan. With that said, time does have a way of healing wounds and it seems like both Kate McGrew and Jerry Ryan have found a good place in their relationship, which I've gotta say, that does make me happy. And while Star Trek Voyager was canceled after the seventh season, both of these characters do live on. Jerry Ryan has reprised the role of Seven of Nine in the Paramount Network series, Picard. 
and Kate Mulgrew will be providing the voice talent for the Nickelodeon series Star Trek Prodigy. I certainly found this story interesting when I first learned about it, and I guess it should come as no surprise that not all actors involved in a TV show always get along. I am glad that they are both doing well, and that it seems like any tension that existed in the past has been resolved. Now what about you? Did you watch Star Trek Voyager when it aired during the late 1990s? If so, what did you think about the addition of Seven of Nine in the fourth season? And had you ever heard about the feud between Mulgrew and Ryan? Now, I look forward to reading your comments. Also, I would greatly appreciate it if you would consider subscribing to my channel, where I generally talk about the music, TV shows, and movies that I loved while growing up in the 70s, 80s, and 90s. Thank you so much for watching. Stay safe out there, and have a great day.